Hi guys, it's me, Mystic. Um, I look really bad on camera right now. One, I don't know, I, I just do not feel good, and I'm like, I don't know. It's like I've been running all day long, so I just have my hand ready to go. But today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do a quick and easy hairstyle. It's a half up half down bun um i wear this quite often actually um because you know it's easy and i have curly hair but you can also do it with straight hair and then like curly ends for church or just you know have it straight depending on your reference so what you need for this hairstyle is a ponytail bobby pins. This time I'm going to use small bobby pins because I feel like whenever I do like the little bun, I mean it's decent size, you know, that the small ones are better since it's not all of my hair. Some water, some spray gel, and some hairspray. You guys want to say hi to my dog? Come here. She's my puppy. Her hair is always in her face. And she's my dog, Lola May. She's in the bathroom floor playing with her ball. Why? I don't know. Hey, look, ready? Cookie! So, now she's out. Um, Life, guys, as a dog mom. I'm also a cat mom. But, comment down below if you guys have animals that are always up your butt. Anyway, what I'm going to start with, oh, you also need a comb. Key here. I know that just, what I'm going to start doing is my hair is already back from um, my ponytail. But I'm just going to divide the section that I'm going to put up and leave the rest down. You can always put more or less hair depending on what you want to do. And then I'm just going to take water and kind of spray it. Help calm down my frizzes. I only have, I like suction like this, like a square, I guess, ish. I don't know really what to call it. More or less, it's a square. And then what I'm going to do to frame my face is take little sections a little section like this kind of like might just have that one because I can't seem to find another piece does anyone else have that struggle Maybe I'll do it right here. Let's pull some hair out. Mm. Maybe not. I don't like how that looks. Alright. So once you have your ponytail slip back to the way you want it now you're just going to put it on a ponytail and then on your last loop around 
you're going to do your little base. I'm going to pull hair to give me some volume up here. And then now you have this and the rest of your hair is hanging down. So now I'm just going to pull this because we're not really just going to, we're not really going to have a base if that makes any sense. And then, what I like to do with the rest of this hair is kind of divide it in half. So I still have like hair hanging down. And then I'm just going to twist the half that I took, lift the hair up, and twist it around the ponytail to hide it. Because... Obviously, we don't want people knowing that or seeing our ponytail. Alright, so I'm just pinning that down. And now I'm going to take a bobby pin and pull it down and pin it. I pin it, like, on my scalp, but I also pin it into the ponytail. I'm going to do the same thing for this side. And then, once you have your bases down, then you just kind of start pulling. Giving it the full aspect. And you take another one, and I just kind of go like this and pull this area and kind of stick it in the again into the ponytail I probably look really weird doing this it doesn't want to stick okay so once that's done okay now you're just going to pull it to give it more volume Okay, I'm going to have two bobby pins and just go like that. It probably would help if, like if you don't want your bobby pins to show, me personally, I don't care. Then you can always use like your hair color bobby pins, but my hair is like an Ar auburn red so oh my gosh. it's kind of hard to find body pins my color brown works okay now I'm just going to divide my hair going down like so so I can fix this. This right here, I don't you guys can't really see it, but it's kind of frizzy. And if you're wearing this to church, you know. Or it's a perfect like date. Or whatever. So I'm just running my fingers through my hair. And this is just water. Like water in my fingers always work first or better. Okay. She got my spray gel. And I'm just gonna spray it. It also probably work really good if you have mousse, but I ran out of mousse. So and all I have is spray gel. So, you know, work with what your mama gave you. Or what you still have. And then I'm just spraying my ends. My hair so long, I didn't really, like, frame the shot. 
sure you get the pieces that all right so here's like the frizzy ish side here's like the more tamed down side let me just toss that back Now I'm just going to repeat. This is water. Now here's like the rest of the ponytail. And then I always scrunch it or, you know, clump it up. It was really fast, really easy. Um, if you have straight hair, you could probably do like the fan bun. But if you want more like texture, you could probably just curl your hair all over and then do it. Um, so here's the back view. I don't know if y'all can see. Oh. I'm all like my tippy tippy toes. But yeah, that is my half up, half down bun tutorial. It's really fast, really easy, really simple, especially like if you're like running late for church or running late for work, but you still want to look professional and put together and like you actually put effort in your hair guys does anyone feel that just me i always want to look professional or look put together even though like maybe your life's falling apart or you ran out you ran late and you only had like three to four minutes like the faster and the more you do it the faster um it becomes faster if that makes sense um but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Bye guys!